What's up, everybody? Jason from jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2020 Panini Absolute Fat Pack Break uh, Football. Five box break. Random division number seven just sold out. We can chase some kabooms. We haven't hit any kabooms yet, and I'm hoping in this break we do. Um, like I said, this is the retail version of Absolute, so there's no guarantee in anything. But hopefully, potentially, we can get one here in this break. And again, it's eight total spots. Everybody gets a random division in the NFL. Remember, no veteran common ship. And chase some kaboom inserts, rookies, five boxes of fat pack retails. So, here are the dice roller. Here's the customer names from Cody down to Fabian, last spot mojo. And then we got the AFC North down to the NFC West. So, let's roll the dice. And we got ourselves a four and a four, eight the hard way. Good luck. Eight times. Those customer names and divisions. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All righty. Eight times. Rodney down to Michael. <coughs> All right, eight times. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight. Eight times. AFC North, down to the NFC North. All right, so Rodney, you have the AFC North. So, of course, you know, AFC North would be, you know, Browns, Steelers, Ravens. Bengals, etc. Uh, Fabian, you have the AFC South. Riza with the NFC West. Steve with the AFC East. Michael Gallucci with the NFC East. Cody with the AFC West. Of course, that's at Justin Herbert with the Chargers. Uh, Joshua Browning, you have the NFC South. And Michael S., you have NFC North. And I believe that'll have uh, Justin Jefferson. Um, I did have the checklist here, I want to say, for the Kaboom set. I, I can drop it in the link. I could drop the link in the chat, I should say, sorry. Besides the rookie kabooms, of course, I mean, you still have chances at other veterans, including Brady, Mahomes, Lamar Jackson, Rodgers, you know, all the way down to Adrian Peterson and Barry Sanders and whatnot. And then I believe this starts the rookie class here. Um, this one has, you know, Joe Burrow, Tua, Herbert, Love, Hurt, CeeDee Lamb, Ruggs, Clyde Edwards-Elair, Jerry Judy, and Chase Young. And then, of course, like I said, I believe, I think almost every division have a chance at least one, one uh, kaboom uh, with one team. So hopefully, like I said, we can get some here, guys. Um, so I'm going to alphabetize it by the uh, division. I'm going to go grab the boxes really quick, grab some water. Um, like I said, if no trades, then we'll just stick with what you got.
guys. <clears throat> yeah, let's get a kaboom, man. That's all I want. That's all I want right here, man. That's all I want. All right, guys. Let's just close the trade window then. Stick with what you got. Give me one minute really quick. All right, so the next break is that did sell out is um, um, is tier one. So tier one did sell out, guys. Way to work. So we're gonna do the absolute now. Then we'll do the sell pack. Then we'll do tier one, and then hopefully, like I said, we can get the hobby done. We're down to six. We're pretty close. Get two box hobby break done, and then hopefully, potentially, get these immaculate breaks done. Maybe we'll do a little filler, a little. A little RMB. I'll text Nick and see what, what if he wants to do one. But we're that close, guys. So let's just knock out that last team. All right, man. Let's do this. Uh, Mike, I don't know if you've seen the 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 website right there, but there's a little filler break where we're giving away ten spots in Ash National Treasures first off the line. We have to do two of those fillers. So once we sell out the no the number one mini helmet break, there's a link right there I just dropped. Then we have to do a second one, and then we can sell out uh, first off the line. So basically, we pre took out twenty spots. That's why it sold out so quick. <clears throat> you know, I can always put back ten spots if you guys really wanted to. And sell 10 straight up and only have to do one more filler. But I feel like, you know, that might take a little longer. So if we not got the first filler, give away 10 spots. I mean, then we just got to do one more. <clears throat> so there you go, guys. Like I said, if that would, I, I'm not sure if that's gonna go tonight, man. But it'll definitely go by tomorrow. Definitely, I'm not. I'm very positive that if it doesn't go tonight, it'll go tomorrow. Oh, for sure. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I just got to check back in every once in a while. Like I said, the break schedule is always there for you guys. So if you see it on there, you know, most likely it's going to break tonight. If you don't see it, then it's probably not. Or because I just haven't went through orders yet. Uh, but like I said, I'm, I'm pretty confident. If it doesn't go tonight, it'll definitely go tomorrow. And uh, I'll be back tomorrow. I feel like 2 o'clock should be same time. And, you know, it's already, what, 11 o'clock almost on the East Coast, so... You know, some people are going to bed already, maybe. Enjoying their last... Enjoying their, uh... Enjoying the last couple... Last two days of just... Maybe off work and back to work on Monday. So, I'm sure we're enjoying. Did you see a kaboom? Oh, thank God if you did. Blacklock.
Yeah, just like all the other ones, guys, I'll be playing. I'll be uh, penny sleeving some of the biggest rookies, of course. The other, you know, A, A, Bs, or, you know, <laughs> we'll just uh, put to the side and we'll all penny sleeve, you know, top level stuff later. Just to continue on. Tua. Well, I mean, we're due for one, I feel like. I mean, there's no guarantee that there is one in this whole case, but, I mean, I've done a, a case, a couple cases of this stuff, and there's always been at least, like, one or two in the whole case, so I'm hoping, man. Anthony Gordon. CD Lamb Introductions. Peoples Jones. Kirby. Dan Jefferson. Lynn Belden. Oh, there's color here though, and it's Kenneth Murray to 199. Steven Montes, T. Higgins. Jalen Hurts. Fire over Zeller. Chase Young. Visco, Zach Moss, Joe Burrow, Chase Claypool. Paul Duggar. All right, so this deck right here, guys, we'll penny sleeve those later. Let's put them to my right over here. <clears throat> All right, next one.
next box. Antonio Gibson. All the receivers, like they come back to back to back to back. <laughs> you get like CD Lamb, KJ Hamler, Denzel Mims, uh, all that good stuff. Herbie, that is a exclusive green foil. Exclusive only to retail. That's a nice one right there for the AFC West. Darnell Mooney, Jalen Rager, Joey B, Nate Stanley, Uh, sorry, Chase uh, Young. Willie Gage Jr., <clears throat> C.D. Lamb, Introductions, Brandon Ayuk, Donovan Peoples-Jones. Jeff Okuda, Foil. CJ Henderson, Joe Burrow. Little Herbie. Van Jefferson. Kenneth Murray. Thanks, Nevins. DJ Dallas. Justin Jefferson. Jawan Jennings. J.K. Dobbins. Cam Akers. <clears throat> buzz buzz what's going on man yeah you know i was out for a couple weeks with covid and uh much better now and uh able to come back to work so definitely happy to be back i missed missed work i mean i don't know how many people can say that but i definitely missed work and breaking for you guys and you know missed the hobby <clears throat> All right, third box, guys.
Because honestly, man, I wasn't really wasn't really paying attention to too much sports. So you're telling me that the rec, the Cubs are talking about letting everyone go, like like Darvish and Chris Bryant and all those guys, or I haven't really kept up with sports the last couple of weeks. <clears throat> Go to the Nationals? Wow. Well, what, what, are the Nats just showing more interest in him? I mean, man, him on the Nationals would be pretty crazy. Oh! <laughs> didn't even know, Rex. <laughs> I didn't know Darvish was gone already. Whoa, out of 35, Nate Stanley. That's a nice looking car. <clears throat> yeah, well, so, yeah, you maybe were more asymptomatic, Buzz Buzz. Yeah. I mean, I, I thankfully got. I thankfully didn't have to go through too much. Just more of the flu like symptoms, you know, cough, consistent cough just wouldn't go away. And um, really, really fatigued, just. Just felt super tired, um, dehydrated and stuff like that. But, you know, other than that, I mean, didn't hit me so hard. But the first symptom that I got was just, like, <clears throat> had to clear my throat. Like, I didn't, I I was just like, oh, you know, I'm just, maybe it's a little something. And then the next morning when I woke up with a sore throat, then I was like, all right. I mean, I have to play it safe. You know, I can't just assume that it's just a little cough or a little cold. Like, can't assume nowadays. You know, you got to make sure because I don't want to, I don't want to pass it on to anybody. Uh, you know, when me and my wife woke up that way, um, that Wednesday, a couple of weeks ago, we were just like, you know what, we're going to go get tested, and, um, you know, ended up testing positive, so, <laughs> you know, we just had to quarantine, and like I said, now I'm negative, I, I'm pretty much, everything's gone, but I still have that little cough every once in a while, and I can't just quit to shake off, but, you know, doctors said it's just going to take some time. <clears throat> But yeah, I would have loved to like get some type of antibody test before. I mean, this is, I've not that I've never felt this before, so I know I'm, this might have been my first time. Cause like I said, I've, I've been pretty safe throughout this whole like last nine, ten months, but still managed to, you know, still managed to strike. Wow, how's Joe feel about all this? I haven't talked to Joe in a little bit either, but man, Padres, they got some pitching now. Joey B. <clears throat> Jefferson Green Foil. second half of the third box Gallimore Clyde Edwards Elair Isaiah Simmons, Green Foil. Tua. Talk about Loa. Um, 
Um, it's pinned right there, Ray. Do you want to check it out? But just another pack break after this and tier one are the only other two breaks that are sold out. Jeff Okuda. No worries, Ray. I don't mind answering it. Just let you guys know, you know? <laughs> the pin's always there. And then Nightbot's always dropping it like every like five minutes or so. CJ Henderson, little Joey B. Herbie. Nobody wants to try to potentially get some two RPAs. I mean, are we are we nervous about him or something? You know, and I know Brian Flores is like his coaching has been pretty good though, right? I mean, when he feels that two is not gonna do well, it's just put in Fitzpatrick and then Fitzpatrick just takes over. But then Tua comes in and starts the next week and then does well. You know, I mean, remember he's still the quarterback of the future, guys, and especially with Fitzpatrick out, you know, I think he has COVID this week. I mean, he's gonna have to take over. Like I said, you never know. Nice, Ray. Yeah, well, if you buy them in the first one at least, you know, I always advise to get them throughout the whole case if you could, of course. I know it's a little pricey, but at least I guarantee you some hits. But hey, you get them in that one break, I hope I get you that two in that first break. You know, obviously, besides two, I mean, there's other great, other good rookies, and then I'm sure there's some Dan Marinos in there and, you know, other great legends in that Miami Dolphins checklist, so. <clears throat> Might not all just be about the Tua. But definitely want the Tua for, for anybody that gets them. Alright guys, last two boxes. I'll rip them both together. All right, looks like uh, Ray did get the Dolphins, so <clears throat> we can add Immaculate Football, Pikachu number one, two boxer to the schedule after tier one. So it'll probably take me about another five, ten minutes to get this done. I'll be done by like eight, ten. You know, upload the video, print out the labels. We'll do the pack break. That way it shouldn't take me more than ten minutes. We'll go to tier one. It should take me about 15, 20 minutes. And then, you know, after that, we... Should be, should be breaking that before nine. If anything, should be on the safe side. Maybe by eight forty-five. Oh, yeah. Well, right now, it's 
tied again, right? That's the game I have on, actually. I think Texas A&M just tied it, or potentially a PTA, PTA, PTA way, or PAT way, I should say. Yeah, I mean, 10.5 looking pretty good. They might even win the game. <laughs> All right, four boxes. I mean, uh, two boxes here, guys. Good luck. Keyshawn Vaughn. Antonio Gibson. We got a little Justin Herbert. Patrick Queen, T. Higgins, Cam Akers, Justin Jefferson, Jake Fromm, Zach Moss, Joe Burrow, Chase Claypool. valid Ray I'm sure some people still feel that way too but when we first you know decided to do personals <clears throat> you know I was the one that first started it um, Instagram was just beginning to boom man and you know we got on at the right time and we established a pretty good audience over there <clears throat> you know maybe we can multi do multi platforms in the future but you know it does really well on Instagram to be honest I mean I I, I think I realized why it does you know because quick on the go you hop on just like the app like youtube but quick instagram you pay for your box your pack it's not a crazy line you know um you do it like that and then you can go on with your life you know and people like that but yeah I'm sometimes some sites multi-stream but like i said i we we've, we've established a good crowd on instagram and you know we like it <clears throat> that's true yeah yeah if you want to watch breaks on the tv that's true youtube is the only only one Instagram will probably eventually get there. I mean, they've grown. I mean, I think they've realized that the, their, their Instagram lives is just growing because at one point we had to restart the stream every hour. Now it's like every four hours, four or six hours. So, you know, little by little they're integrating. But, you know, maybe we can do both in the future. But like I said, we we like we like the Instagram and how it's, how it's grown with us and have a great established audience. So I think if anything, it's just like how you said, maybe just multi- streaming and just having them someone on youtube or having the youtube stream exactly on with instagram so that way it doesn't take away the instagram crowd but maybe adds a little youtube crowd but we're just so busy over there it has to kind of be separate so yeah we'd have to have like a separate youtube channel All right, also, guys, we did get that color card. That was DeAndre Hopkins to uh, 149. Xavier McKinney. T. 
Tua Tagovailoa. Cam Akers, foil green. All right, last box right here, guys. I'm hoping there is a good boom in here as well. So there are no, no guarantees. But let's hope here. This last little box right here. And I see some color. Von Miller to 199. So four out of our five boxes did have some color, which is an improvement. Those just have to be pulled out. It's not that big of a sort. JK Dobbins. T Higgins. Xavier McKinney. Clyde Edwards Eler. Tua. This Javon Kinlaw is a beast as well. Jeremy Chen. Cam Akers, green foil. All right, last stack right here, guys. Good luck. CD Lamb. AJ Hamler, Justin Jefferson, Quez Watkins, Jacob Beeson, Jerry Judy, C.D. Lamb, K.J. Hamler, Denzel Mims. And the last stack right here, guys. Good luck. Jake Luton, Claypool. There's the Claypool rookie. Jalen Hurts. A.J. Dillon. Jonathan Taylor, AJ Terrell, Rager, Albert O, Jordan Love, Zavisca, Zach Moss, and Joe Burrow. Alrighty, guys. <laughs> so there you go. Uh, we didn't get no kabooms. We did get four color cards, including this nice out of 35. No, it's not the biggest 38 Stanley, but there's DeAndre Hopkins. Kenneth Murray, Von Miller, 
And then, of course, all of this big stacker here rookies will be penny sleeves right there later. These are already penny sleeves, so they could be top loaded as well. The bigger, bigger rookies. So there you go, guys. That was Absolute Fat Pack Break number seven, random divisions on jazbeescasebreaks.com.